from 28 yards away for an Aggie upset win. And it's good. He got it. The second largest crowd in the history of this stadium has seen the upset of the number one team in the country. And Seth Small comes up big. I thought it was going to go left, but it knuckled back in. What a game. What a finish. And what a happy group of Aggies, including their head coach. He said you had to trust the process to get to this point. Don't worry about who you're playing. Just play every play like it's the biggest one. The biggest one was with one second left. And the winning streak of Alabama is over, and the winning coach is with Jamie Erdahl. Coach, you put yourself in that position because you had confidence in Zach Calzada. What about his day today? I'll tell you what, it's amazing. He's went through some tough trials and tribulations. Like I say, you need you need time in the saddle when you're a quarterback to learn. He grew up, he made the plays. We played well around him. Our defense was outstanding. We made the special team plays. But Zach's leadership and consistency, especially we didn't move it for four straight drives in the second half. And the lead us down on those two drives was remarkable. And the kids around him made the plays. It was a total team. Our assistant coaches and our players did a hell of a job. You've been through it, not just this season, but with this program, and you just beat your old boss. How does it feel? Well, listen, I have great respect for Nick. I always say that. He's, he's one of the best that ever did it. And I learned a lot when I coached with him. We had a lot of good times. But we got a heck of a program here. We can be special here if we allow ourselves to keep out of the win. We've put some words on ourselves. We just got to play the rest of the year out. But it was a great win for our organization. Congratulations, Coach. Thank Go you. celebrate. Thank you.